what about the uh, you know branches like mechanical and civil uh, what do you think are the prospects in placement for these students it is true that a uh, good chunk of our students go on analytics side okay because that's where i think the iit education is good at okay you have to look at that also but we do see fairly good number of uh, people who are going into the so the infrastructure and manufacturing because if you are talking about mechanical civil you know and nowadays you know there are a lot of nice things have come in the mechanical and other sides like for example additive manufacturing then the 3d printing and others so it has also revolutionized this whole you know so if you look at a lot of this design and other concept okay it's in this uh, particular space there is a fairly good amount of hiring of our students okay see you have to look at today's way of doing uh, i think the from the industry perspective so there would be jobs which would actually define you know how to design something what are the design validation and you know the planning so and secondly it's actual the implementation actual the shop floor or the job shop you know you could say that so typically our students okay go for the back office work so you may not see them in the front that you see that you know so this because that's where their strengths are and any company would always try to leverage that i think that's why you will see that uh the number of jobs may be less okay if, if you compare overall but there are some significant number of jobs still there and uh, our people do go for that will you advise students to go for mechanic branches like mechanical and civil or like the trend is going for it related fields will this be happening in the future as well it's difficult i tell you one thing typically you know you see all over the uh, country the number of uh, i would say the graduates in computer science it is lot more than in another other areas okay that's because you know before this uh, i think dot com and all india invested quite a bit on this particular area and it paid off okay so many of the common people in india they do see that there is a great opportunity for people okay now if you look at some of the big service industries that you know we have uh, whether infosys cognizant whatever the other things you know uh, wipro they hire a large number of people who come you know from that particular discipline they want to take people and they solve a lot of the services industry from across the globe and there is a great potential you should india should leverage that okay and this is where we have i think a lot of opportunity for people to go and uh, you know get a good job and make a nice living okay. but you also need you know see when you actually have all these uh, you know the i would say the computer and it but you also need other areas in a country for development you need infrastructure you need manufacturing see the china they've had like you know how they boosted up the entire manufacturing industry so you do need that okay so that has to be encouraged so it has to be collective you know process there has to be mechanism to see that we do have manpower you know for this particular set of industry also and also i would say because it may be you know there are prospective you know students career you know uh, i think minded people listening to this see when you go for some area where a lot more people go it's a crowded space okay so how far do you go because you have to be really great in terms of being the top computer scientist to be absorbed in somewhere or if you have a plan to become like a great professor somewhere or like some of the great individuals you know doing it so competition would also be much i would say higher in that particular case so that has also to be looked at sometime we just go like across the flow but i think people should look into that also.